I'm going to introduce you to my Mark 18 pistol. Um, this is a clear and secure weapon with no magazine, no ammunition in the room. Move quick. If we get engaged out here, I don't want to get sucked into the main house. Visual, second level, top right. Shoot my door. Shot. Ceasefire. I connected. I've got a no shoot deep there. I'm holding main breach. You guys work that. But I do have a laser and a light combo. And when you set something like this up, you want two buttons to be able to activate either of them. Ready or not with mods is now starting to simulate some of these things. And I think it's really interesting to see that stuff come over from the real world in an authentic way and be expressed in games. Shit. Yep. Bathroom. One down. Keep going. Well, the mod that we're looking at today adds a clone correct LA5 and a clone correct M600V Surefire Scout, as well as a dual pressure switch to the Mark 18. What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. For those who are new here, we play tactical shooters and combat simulations, strategy games and things of that nature, but we do it with a twist. We leverage real world experience and knowledge of tactics and doctrine to play those games in a more authentic way so that we can have fun in the process and maybe learn a thing or two. Today we're taking a look at a game called Ready or Not. Most of you guys are familiar with Ready or Not. It is a premier tactical shooter on the PC that allows you to simulate a SWAT experience. It's authentic in that there is an A symmetry to it that's not present in most other tactical games or most other games at all and you have to shout out to suspects to ask them to surrender you can employ lethal and non-lethal effects um, and it's also extremely moddable and today we're taking a look at a couple of mods that i think are really interesting the first is the map itself we're doing one that's called forest house it's basically an isolated compound in the woods it's extraordinarily well designed a link to it is down in the description below you'll take a look at it here in just a second as the gameplay gets rolling and the second and maybe more interesting for the gun nerds in the group is we're looking at a Mark 18 model that has been upgraded with a clone correct Surefire M600V Scout Light as well as an LA5 with a Unity pressure switch to boot. And for those of you guys who aren't necessarily gun dudes, I want to introduce you to my Mark 18 pistol. Um, this is a clear and secure weapon with no magazine, no ammunition in the room. And I bust it out only for demonstration purposes. One, so you guys can see that beautiful Mark 18 aesthetic. And two, so we can talk a little bit about the way that we set up some of the attachments on our rifle for real world application, uh, be it you know, home defense, community defense, target shooting, uh, combat, or what have you. The Mark 18 is an interesting weapon. It's made by Daniel Defense. It's got a 10.3 inch barrel. Uh, that would make it a short barreled rifle unless you have it in a pistol configuration as mine is here. And it's something that I've always wanted to own. I'm really, really glad to own it now. And the reason I've always been interested in it is because it was for a long time and still is in many places, the standard issue SOCOM short barreled rifle in 5.56, um, common in use with the uh, Ranger Regiment and various other special operations forces, certainly uh, special forces uh, and elsewhere in the Department of Defense. And that's just a well-known fact that that contract got issued. And what you'll see on the front of my Mark 18 pistol is I do indeed have a surefire light and I have a laser and I have a two button pressure switch. And the way that works is one of the buttons will fire the light, which you guys can't see, but it's going on my ceiling right now. And the other one will fire the laser, which you can't see because it's infrared. I'm poor, so my Mark 18 is not a LA5 or a PEC-15, um, but I do have a laser and a light combo. And when you set something like this up, you want two buttons to be able to activate either of them. So I've got a dimple on my light button, and then there's no dimple for my infrared laser, so I can differentiate between the two um, day and night without having to look at it. And then I've got the laser mounted on top. You can mount the laser anywhere. I prefer on top because you get less lateral deviation whenever you zero that laser under infrared so you can accurately engage targets out to range. It makes it easier to zero. You can accomplish something similar on the side. Um, it just means you have to know your holds, know your offset, and uh, be you know really, really careful whenever you zero the laser, make sure it's dead on. And then of course, I, I have the light. And my light is not mounted you know, on the Picatinny. I'm using uh, the Haley Strategic Thorn Tail to get it up and at a you know kind of the two o'clock or the you know the 230 position just to give myself some more hand space um, i've also got that light way forward this device you see on the muzzle of the pistol is a um, it's a surefire blast diffuser it's not a suppressor not a silencer 
Um, it's simply meant to, to mitigate the blast overpressure that comes off the war compensator underneath it. Now, how you set up your rifle, your pistol, your weapon platform comes down a little bit to preference, a little bit to common sense, a little bit to experience, and some of it's just simply non-negotiable. When it comes to a laser-like combo, in my opinion, I think it's pretty standard, pretty much required. If you've got the rail space available to work with, the laser needs to go on top for the reasons that we already talked about. I'm a right-handed shooter, so my light always goes on the right side, or in this case, you know, the, the two o'clock position on the right side. The reason for that is when I go to present this pistol, that is out of the way of my hand. So I can manipulate the buttons on top if I need to. Um, I can manipulate the laser if I need to. I can even come all the way over and activate the light with my thumb on the back of the light if my pressure switch goes bad for whatever reason. So I've got good ergonomics without it obstructing my ability to properly grip the rail of this Mark 18 pistol and engage targets as needed. So why are we talking about all of that in the context of Ready or Not? Well, the mod that we're looking at today adds a clone correct LA5 and a clone correct M600V Surefire Scout, as well as a dual pressure switch to the Mark 18. I'm also using a Unity riser mod with an Aimpoint Micro T2 red dot on that Mark 18. I'm running an EOTech on this guy, but I do have a Unity fast riser on it. Um, again, ergonomics matter, right? So this riser here gets my EOTech up high over the laser and stuff up front. The Unity's already, excuse me, the EOTech's already pretty beefy, so I don't necessarily need it. But when you put a red dot or a holographic optic on a riser, it gets it up off of the pistol brace in this case, or a stock in the case of a traditional rifle, so that if you have over-the-ear hearing protection, or if you're in a CQB environment and you need good heads-up awareness, you can keep your head square to the target. You get a chin weld or a mid-cheek weld rather than a, uh, a traditional cheek weld, and you can engage targets rapidly without having to really get your eye down behind the rifle. You get more of a heads-up shooting position. And Ready or Not with mods is now starting to simulate some of these things. And I think it's really interesting to see that stuff come over from the real world in an authentic way and be expressed in games. Today we're playing with some buddies that you'll recognize from the channel. And if this stuff interests you, if you like learning about guns, if you like learning about video games that you may not have been exposed to before, and combining these two things that I'm extremely passionate about, and hopefully you are too, I'd encourage you guys to subscribe to the channel. Now let's go ahead and take a look at today's gameplay. Here we go. Raj, nods down, make sure you're running IR lasers. I'm holding main compound push long to clear the external structure on my list. Visual, uh, second floor, second window from that left. Another mover right there, guys, on that laze. Hands up! Looks unarmed. I got a shooter first floor. Yeah. Get down now. He's down. Cease fire on the main breach. Yeah. Move to cover, keep working that right compound. Work the door. Check it. Watch out. Alright. I got it. Minus one internal, the main structure. Understood. Alright. Secondary structure clear, coming back to you. Raj, I got a, looks like an unarmed mover on my lays here in front of the door. Go ahead and cross. Let's clear that other external structure off to the left. Gun. Sliding left, working him. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Fuck that. Drop him. Drop him. He's down. He didn't drop that. Okay. Work this guy. I'm sliding to the green side of the main compound to clear Talk to element. black side. Talk copies all. Proceed with your mission. Work that corner, please. No, fac no factor left. The uh, rest of the side's clear. Okay, let's take this entrance. Mag. Up the window on your right. That's me, boy. Arms outstretched. <laughs> Take a step forward. Drop one shooter. Work towards main breach. Call whenever you guys are up there. I'll come up with a bang. Don't make this ugly. Get down now. I'm gonna set the door. That's me. 
at the door now. Prepping Multiple bay. movers inside. Understood. Door's locked. Ready. Thanks, Prep. Two man, take a knee. Okay. Bang out. Hands where I can see them. Walking left. Can you put your hands Door up, left, please. working it. All right, all right. Hands up. Right, uh, CV, CV. Throwing this real quick. Can you guys see my laser in the hallway? Oh, yep. I'm closing this. So you got long line of sight. You guys can work that hallway. G man, hope that you got it. We clear right. All right, I'm with you guys right. G man, hold what you got. Got it. Hands up now. Hey, blue, blue turn around, face hallway. I got her. Hypoxia, you and I are taking this room. You're taking the no shoot and take it. Make that two no shoots plus stairs. Call in set. You're not serious, right? Civilian secured. secured. Ready for pickup. I'm gonna plate stairs. Roger, trailers inbound. You got him. This one's secure. I don't have any needles on me. Civilian is secured and ready for transport. Talk to okay. element. Are we cleaning? Roger, Roger entry team. Door. Great Roger. work. Keep okay. going. I I'm with you. Roll. Blue, you can move down that hallway. We're parallel to you on the right. That's where I can see them. Watch G Man, he's deep left of you. Hands up now! I'm not armed. You got two no shoots in there? Got it. It's coming on the hall. Open it. Alright, watch that. Yep. Door's locked. I'm complying. Second no shoot came out. Hands up now! Hypoxia. Actually, blue push to us. Blue push to us, right here. Push him back, push him back. Down the hallway, brother. On my lays, I'm circling it. On the hallway? Oh, yeah, I actually went all the way around. I got a closed door. It'll the closed door on the right here. Should connect. You can work the closed door Should if you connect. need to. Yeah. Hear him. Nope, basement. All right. Gosh. Fucking bypass it for now, then. We're not clearing that with just two of us. Go help them. I'll cover no, this. No negative. Moving. All right, hold these two. Hold them. Hypoxia, stand by to enter. Roger. Clear here. Let's button them up. Down. Talk to element. Roger entry team. That's me breaching. I wanna go home. They want more trouble. Don't worry. Talk to entry team. Great work, entry team. Oh, Keep second. it up. Okay, it's nothing personal, buddy. Set. Talk reporting. Roger. I got a gun on the Copy ground over here. I'm going to grab. Notifying trailers. With you. Alright, blue. You get to watch basement since you opened the door. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. You can get the gun. We're gonna work basement next, guys. Got it. Yep. Alright, roll to basement. Hang out. Okay. Last man, G. It's a shit show. Get down. Okay, now. okay. Two no shoots. Contact like right. It's down. Bandaging. You good? I need a two in here. Thank you. I got this guy. Put your hands where I can see it. Talk to entry team. Affirmative entry team. Got him. Please, I need to get out of here. Just door like behind. Jobs, door behind. Talk to here. element. On this. Copy entry team. Yeah, it's good over there. Trailers. Ready for pickup. Talk to We're entry going team. Long. Roger that. Trailers on route. That's face clear. Clear left. Last room for sure. Clear. Roger. Roger. Alright, basement clear. Oof. Pushing up. Hypoxia, hold high. I'm gonna get a nine banger oh. up and around the corner. Call when you have a bang prepped on the other side. Bang prep. All right, on me. Three, two, one, breach. Multiple doors. I don't like our side at all. Negative. Watch the door behind. Door behind me, please. You get hypoxia? Yeah. Notifying on the right side, G. Got a guy coming on the Watch the door behind me, please. Hold I got two you. doors. I got two. I got two entryways. I've got everything in front. Just get the thing behind me. Hey, Raj, Raj. Hey, I've got, me, I've got your laser that. right here, guys. You see that? No, I see it. Okay. Hypoxia, hold what you got. I'm gonna work left. Ballistic breach. 
Drop the gun. Do it now. Set. That's friendly lays right there. Friendly lays. Raj. You got that? I'm opening this right, door. Good. All right. Don't make this ugly. Put your hands up. That's a friendly Arms peek on that door. I'm going to go and clear along in the hallway. Is that door behind the snow factor now, Blue? Yeah, Raj. All right. We're going to work this door on the left. I got a no shoot. Get down and put your hands up. Get here. down and put your hands up. Don't make this ugly. Multiple no shoots on the right. All right. I got one as well. Raj, perfect. I'm going to hold up so we're not getting hot walled hey, by you guys. She's pointing hands deep, up. dude. She was pointing at this door. It's short left. Just yeah. hold for now. I don't want to push so we don't get engaged if they have to take shots. You guys are good to push to me yeah, if you guys can get to right there. Negative. We've got rooms on this side. We have to clear still. We've got multiple unarmed contacts. Okay. Hypoxia, can you crawl backwards to me, please? Hands up now! Just keep coming, keep right. coming, keep coming. All the way to the back right corner if you can. All right. She says this now is we should short. be good. Hypoxia, can okay. you see this guy? Or this, All right. This chick I'm right going. Here? Okay, I'm flipping it. Get Protect down, my back. Put your hands up, hands up. Friendly, 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 friendly. Yep, friendly. Short room. This door room. connects right here. Okay, I'm gonna zip That's her up. Watch this door left. behind her. Contact. Contact in custody. I'm gonna move her out of the way as soon as I get her zipped oh, up. Oh God. She was she was gesturing to that door. Civilian restraint. Ready for Trailers pick. incoming. Moving to no shoot back. into the hallway. All right, she's clear. The same lamp in my house. Hey, so that's that's the door she was gesturing to, just so you're tracking. Got it. We're going to trigger this angle. Hypoxia, you're at risk. G-Man, you're one. Yep. Bathroom. One down. Going. Clear. Nice work. Contact neutralized. Dude, that's Talk wild that AI Talk does that. Team. Tag him and keep moving. Yeah, just, that was, uh, that's the first helpful, time I've seen actually. that. Are we? Oh, nope, no, we got to clear along to hypoxia. You had a shooter through there previously, right? Contact neutral. We'll work that one. Talk reporting. You want to bang? Affirmative entry team. Yeah. Get down and show me your Don't hands. This ugly. Put your hands up. Closet. Get down and put your hands up. Negative, it doesn't right, actually happen. Police this guy up. Weapon. You got one in your view. Raj, prep bang. Prep. Get down and show me put your hands up, One hands unarmed down. rate compliant. I got an armed dude here that surrendered. Please watch him until I get him in cuffs. Got him. Cuffed and secure. I want to talk to a lawyer. Talk to that Elliot. is hard to believe. Roger that. that. Trailer's incoming. Proceed with caution. Let's nice. Go, boys. Page up, dog. Talk to entry team. Excellent work, entry team. Report to center for debrief. <sighs> AK gang? <laughs> Only one unauthorized use of force. Oh, it was the one in the breach at the beginning for sure because it was just like a guy that wouldn't surrender. So, so to... yeah, cool. Don't exit to menu, right? Uh, don't exit to menu. Yeah, quarters. All right, who we got? I'm up. That's a few minutes. Whatever you go, we're ready. Yeah, lobbies.